Now, you watch some of those cowboy movies and a new car, and a cowboy rode into town on his horse and they say there's a new sheriff in town. Well, in South Africa, there's a new beauty brand here on home soil. Tammy Taylor Nails, who is a leader in the Tammy Taylor brand in over 10,000 professional salons worldwide. It's also an American professional nail and beauty product which the professional nail and beauty industry, nail technicians and cosmetologists rely on. Now, it's a rag to reach a story, this one. With Tammy Taylor, who opened her first salon in 1981 in the U.S., she was only 18 years old, believe it or not, with only a $400 budget. But for over 30 years, she has developed a comprehensive business, including nail products, tools, and procedures that help shape the way the nail industry operates. Now, joining us today is the owner, sole distributor, and sole license holder in South Africa, representing Tammy Taylor Nails here in South Africa. Mel Fulyun, Mel, a very good morning good to you. Good morning, Elvis. Well, I can tell you, you look like a brand ambassador to oh, me. thank you. <laughs> thank you very much. First and foremost, tell us about the products, Tammy, uh, Tammy Taylor Nail Range, and, and is it, it, it is now available in South Africa, correct? It is, absolutely. Mm -hmm. um, you know, you just said it all. When you started talking about Tammy Taylor, I just felt the love coming into my heart again. We are so passionate about this Tammy Taylor product. And let me tell you, she is the Chuck Norris of the <laughs> nail industry, guaranteed. <laughs> Tammy Taylor nails have developed products that I cannot tell you, everything she touches mm -hmm. just turns into gold. It's the very first time that there's a self-leveling product mm -hmm. and we guarantee 100% non-lift on the nails. So the what does non-lift mean? It means that even if to the, ignore, the in, in, ill informed, you know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. So what it means is that even if you swim, if you if your nails always used to lift, mm -hmm. uh, most women have a problem with their nails, and that is lifting problems. That's okay. when the acrylic starts lifting at the back. Mm -hmm. And this is the first time that we guarantee that your nails won't lift, and you can walk with it till six weeks. It won't lift. It is magic. Tammy Taylor is absolute. She's, she's magic. Okay, so the non-lift is one issue. But what makes the product different from others that's currently in the market? And, and is there an appetite for, an appetite rather, for American products on, on, our, on our market, in our market here in South Africa? There is absolutely a market. I think mm -hmm. the, there's enough people in this world mm -hmm. and there's, everyone has a, has a different taste for, for, for mm -hmm. anything else. But what makes it special for us, it's mm -hmm. got a secret ingredient that I cannot tell you it's very secret okay. uh, that makes the acrylic swell and shrink with your nail and with the temperatures mm -hmm. and that's also why it doesn't lift mm -hmm. our full color acrylic is non marbling mm -hmm. it's also the first full color acrylic we have over 100 colors that does not marble and Again, that's, that's nail technician language. Mm -hmm. Maybe you won't understand it. But I won't, I promise it's you. It's just, <laughs> it's perfect. But it's something that they would yeah. understand. How affordable is the product for the South African market? It's very affordable. Mm -hmm. There's a market for everyone, like I said. Mm -hmm. We are not the cheapest brand. Mm -hmm. We like to say that our brand is affordable, but it's also for a, for a different market. Mm -hmm. You know, for ladies... Um, that likes wearing nails. So it's, it's for everybody. Mm -hmm. It's very affordable. If you see the quality, people mm -hmm. stream for this nails. Mm -hmm. they, they stand queues for this nails. Mm -hmm. And we are so fully booked. And every day there are about 50 new people that wants to distribute and wants to, to open salons with our brand because they are so excited about what's going on. Now for the ill-informed again, like me, <laughs> is it nail polish or is it nails that you put on? Is it uh, artificial nails? That's a very good question. Mm -hmm. Thank you for the question. We import acrylic products. Mm -hmm. We also import gel products. So basically, let, let me explain it. It's like cement. Mm -hmm. So you create a little ball, you place it on the nail, it levels itself out. And you just stroke it out and there you have a beautiful nail. So mm -hmm. that is acrylic. Mm -hmm. And then we have our gel. We've got builder gel and we've got gel polish. Mm -hmm. So for the woman that does not like acrylic, we've got a gel polish. So basically you polish it on, you bake it, and you have a permanent color on your nail that's not going to lift or chip or you can wash dishes. It's non-scratch. It is chemical resistant and it's chip free. It won't chip. Mm -hmm. So our, our Tammy Taylor is just... 
It's our queen. If it's not scratch, I'll take it any time because then I won't get scratch. <laughs> but Perfect. would you say, though, that South African women on average spend more on their nails and beauty products than, any, uh, than their counterparts abroad? Absolutely. I mean, when I, I started doing my nails when I was about 17 years old, mm -hmm. and I never stopped. And even through my hard months, I would make a plan to get my nails done because a, nails are a woman's pride and joy. Mm -hmm. That's the thing that she wants. You can have ugly hair, you can go to a salon, <laughs> you can come back out with ugly hair. You can go in with ugly nails and you can come back out with beautiful nails. <laughs> now, Mel, do you think that there's perhaps an obsession with this type of beauty? We talked about skin bleaching earlier. There's an obsession about beauty and, and how people and, and our women see themselves out in the world. You know what, mm -hmm. I, I heard you saying something about the uh, beauty without cruelty mm -hmm. and I wanted to mention to you that our product is MMA approved, mm -hmm. it's FDA approved, mm -hmm. it doesn't smell. In most salons you would go into a salon you would smell this very strong smell of product. Mm -hmm. uh, but ours don't smell. There's no really a difference, There's, it's not harmful, mm -hmm. but um, I would say that Women are so obsessed with yes. Tammy. It's the talk of the of town, town right now. It's everywhere. Briefly, for those who want to get their nails into it, how do they get hold of Tammy Taylor Nails? Well, we've got our Facebook page, mm -hmm. Tammy Taylor Nails, South Africa. We've got Instagram and all our numbers mm. are on the website, www.tammytaylornails.co.za, and we've got billboards up everywhere. Mm -hmm. So... You'll see us in Pretoria, and this is the billboard. It's so beautiful, and this is the website. Mm -hmm. So you can visit us on the website, and you can find a salon near you mm -hmm. because we also supply to a few salons around South Africa. Mm -hmm. So you can go onto the website and see which salon will be near you. Mel, thank you for getting you your nails into our conversation me. this morning. Thank you so much for that. That is the owner, sole distributor, sole license holder, representing Tammy Taylor Nails right here in South Africa, Mel Phil Yoon. And she makes the perfect candidate for a brand ambassador, doesn't she? Thank well, you. you can let us know what's on your mind. We're asking you that question. Is there perhaps an obsession with beauty in our country? Or what about skin bleaching? Do you think that, it's, uh, that skin bleaching is becoming more prevalent in South Africa, around the globe, on the continent? Let us know on the Facebook page as well. Twitter handle, Twitter handle at SABC Newsroom. Now, more comments here. At least nine people are believed to have been killed when an earthquake struck Japan last night. The magnitude 6.2 earthquake struck near Uyeki, the U.S. Geological Survey said. Dozens of smaller aftershocks followed. Now, let's take a look at some of those comments that have been coming through. Remember to please send your comments to our Twitter handle at SABC Newsroom. Let's take a look at the pictures there that's coming through from